Why, hello all my sexy viewers, this is your host, Descend and X, where X marks the spot for entertainment. In this series, I ask you, the viewer, to ask me any question in the comments section below and I answer my favorites. The gameplay in the background is just a 68-7 and 7 headquarters match on the map carrier. I do apologize if things are a little choppy or if the sound is a little off. I don't know, I've been having problems with my Elgato lately. But please do remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you have not done that already. And feel free to hit me up on Twitter or Facebook. The links are located in the description below. So for starters, the first question comes from I, Crazy Teddy, And his question is, how did your teeth get smashed? Well, long story short, I was riding my bike and I was about 12 years old. My buddy decided he wanted to turn right in front of me, right in front of my front tire. So it made me crash face first. Got a replacement tooth and then ended up swallowing it while eating some pizza just a few months ago. That fake tooth lasted me about 15 years, so uh, yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty bad. But the good news is I should be getting a new one here in May. Uh, the next two questions come from Shockbird98. What is your favorite sport and favorite gun in real life? As for favorite sport, it would be football and the Desert Eagle because the Desert Eagle is effing beast. Question number three comes from SPM Pro. How did you get into, accepted into Machinima? Well, I'll have to look more into this. Honestly, uh, I, I think quality is going to be number one, but it helps if you have around 10,000 views. I don't know if that's uh, what they're looking for, but that's what happened to me. So, yeah, look, look, you know, just give it a try, guys. It might happen for you. Uh, question four hails from 8-Bit Sham. Have you ever pissed the bed and blamed it on an animal? The answer is no. But one time I was at Buddy's, and we decided to sleep on a trampoline outside, and around 2 a.m. I woke up to a huge wet spot, and yeah. Uh, yeah, let's just say that was not me. So yeah, question number five comes from Jacob Laughing. He says, do you have a favorite Call of Duty? Well, my answer would be uh, Call of Duty 4. I spent 23 days played. That's the most I've ever played in any Call of Duty game. I uh, can't remember exactly. That's about 500 hours, roughly. So I, I put a lot of damn work into that game. So I love it. Question number six comes from my buddy Trickshot Studios. Also, Mikish or Dino. They're members of that. Those guys are pretty darn cool. I love those guys. I play with them all the time. Do you prefer Modern Warfare or the Black Ops series? Honestly, of late, I'd have to say the Black Ops because it just seems like they put more into the games in terms of content and DLC. You know, I don't know. It just seems like they, they put so much more work into Black Ops 2 in terms of making it all, uh, you know, uniform and trying to make things fair for everyone. I love the fact they're doing all these buffs and debuffs, you know. I don't know. I don't see too much of it. So, hey, if, if it's helping out everybody, let's let's keep going with that. Uh, but also, you know, Modern Warfare has always been fun for me. I mean, it started with COD 4, and honestly, that, uh, that in itself kind of stuck with me with the Modern Warfare series, so, I don't know, I, I just really, I really can't decide on which one I like more, so, sorry I couldn't give you a better answer to that one. Uh, question number com number seven comes from a dear friend of mine, his name is Killa Wood. Uh, do you think Black Ops 2 has a better connection than Modern Warfare 3, you know, like as in lag? Um, you know, I'd have to go with Modern Warfare 3 because it seems, like, you know, I get a lot less deaths around a corner, and I'm sure everyone knows exactly what I'm talking about when they're dying from a stupid thing around a corner. I don't know, we're not we're not even going to get into that, and that just seems like it happens uh, more in Black Ops 2, so, you know, I'd go with Modern Warfare 3 for, for less lag. A quick question for freaking W. Yeah, that guy's badass. Uh, do you enjoy Black Ops 2? Honestly, well, yes, I do very much. They just need to work on a few flaws, and they have themselves probably one of the best games ever made. Honestly, of uh, the Call of Duty series. Uh, question number nine comes from <laughs> Jaskaran Mangat. I'm sorry if I did not say your name right, but the question is, what was your first console? And honestly, the simple answer is the original NES. I love it. In fact, I just got all my Nintendo games back from my mom, and uh, I hope to have a working Nintendo again so I can play that and... My daughter, maybe she'll get a chance to play Mario Brothers. Man, that's just, that's awesome. That's probably five years from now, but man, that'd be so cool. It was her first thing and one of my first things. So, yeah, moving on here. Uh, question number 10. And I swear we're almost done, guys, so thank you for bearing with me. Uh, question number 10 comes from a guy. I said his name wrong in the first episode, and I'm sorry. He asked me another question. It's Mr. Crybot. 
This question is a long one, but I'll try to answer it quickly. If you were stuck on a deserted island that can only bring three items and three people, who and what would they be? These items can only fit in your suitcase. You know, you guys are more than welcome to answer this down in the comments line. I, I thought it was a really cool question. I don't know where he came out with it, but he also got in my Ask Me Anything uh, the first episode. He's getting into the second one, or I should say the third one now. So I, I'm, I'm pretty stoked about that. Uh, thanks for the support, buddy. I appreciate it. Well, for starters, uh, I'd probably bring a satellite phone to call for help. Simple as that. An awesome knife. You know, so you can run faster in the woods. It's just proven fact that you run faster with a knife. Hunt more efficiently. Maybe some rope. Maybe tie up some things. You know, maybe some tie up some people that I brought with me. But, nah, I'm just, I'm just joking, man. I'm not going to tie anybody up. Or maybe even just a small inflatable laugh that uh, folds up and fits inside the suitcase. Get me home. And as for the people, I bring Bear Gorillas from... Uh, Man vs. Wild, because he knows how to do some survival shit right there. And then uh, the president would probably be the second one for priority, because uh, they definitely going to want to save his ass. Or uh, <laughs> the other thing would be uh, bringing Justin Bieber, because the world just can't go on without him. The last person, I would have to say, would probably be the sexiest woman alive, which in some cases is still Justin Bieber. So yeah, so <laughs> question 11 is from This Is Fudge, as in the fudging boss on YouTube. Oh yeah, like a fudging boss. He knows all about what I'm talking about. So his question is, who's your favorite commentator right now? And uh, honestly, you know, it, it sounds kind of weird. It's uh, it's Serial Assassin. You know, I've been, I've been watching almost all of his videos as of late, probably the last six months or so. And I love every one of them. It gives me inspiration to make more videos and get better at everything I do. So, Serial Assassin, man, you get you get the biggest shout-out of the night, man. I love you. All right, Greg, we're going to move on. You didn't have a question, which is which is quite interesting. Finally, the wa last question comes from that frisky guy. And he asks, you've been subscribed to me. Do you really enjoy my content? And the answer is yes, bro. I truly enjoy your content. I think you do a great job. You have some great beast gameplay. Seen those uh, Call of Duty shots, what was it, yesterday or the day before? Freaking pulling off the... 360 no scopes Pfft. old school buddy old school keeping it real with your awesome commentary so i like your stuff man just, just keep bringing it you bring it i'm watching everything you're putting out so whatever all right so well that's it for today folks please send me those questions so i can do more of the series because i truly love the interaction if you don't already know i respond to 99 percent of the comments so talk my ear off again please like comment subscribe if you haven't already done so I would like to do this series more often, so let me put those questions in the comment section. Till the next episode, remember to send an X, or X marks the spot for entertainment. And as a last note, please, please, we're getting there, guys. I think we're at like 430 subs. Let's try to get to 500 subs by the end of the month. And boy, man, I don't know. I'd just be super stoked. Let's throw a party or something, guys. So it's it's coming to the end. Uh, I think I already told you it's 68-7 uh, and seven on Carrier. Headquarters, nothing nothing special, guys. I'm sure you've seen much better. And I'll see you at the end of the video. Alright, guys, thanks for watching the video. On the left-hand side, you'll see where I have my previous video. I'd like you to all check that out. And on the right-hand side, we got our mystery video. Not going to let you know what it is, but please do check it out. Guys, remember, X marks the spot for entertainment. And this is Descendant Out. Peace.